Hey guys, welcome back in CodeSphere. So today in this video, I will show you that how you can delete profile image from Firebase storage. Fine guys. So today in this tutorial, you can see that when I clicked on this hamburger icon, so it will show the bottom sheet. And guys, this time when I will click on the button delete and I will choose the button yes. So it will also delete the profile from storage. Fine. And this time guys, when I will refresh this uh, storage bucket, so there will be no image. Fine. You can see that there are no files and if i will open this real time database so the data is deleted from here also fine so today in this tutorial i'll be showing you you can see that there is no data fine so today in this tutorial i'm going to show you that how you can do this so without wasting time let's start so guys as you can see that uh, first of all what we will do is uh, you can see this is social media app fine so here first thing that we have to do is guys simply come in this bottom sheet and uh, as i have promised that uh, today in this tutorial we will delete the profile image and also the data from the real time database so guys for this first thing that uh, you have to do is uh, yeah simply declare a string and that is going to be just simply a url fine so simply write string and that will be url and guys after this what we will do is uh, simply come inside this reference and here you have to write reference dot get dot add on complete listener new on complete listener fine guys then after this simply semicolon and here we will write if task dot get result dot exist so guys basically we are retrieving the value of that url task dot get result dot get string and string value is url fine as we have created in the create profile done and uh, if you can give uh, anything in else you know guys you can uh, leave it empty but sometime it create uh, crashing of app on real runtime so it will be better if you face this problem crashing of app so you can surround it in try and catch fine so it will not crash fine guys so after this what we will do is uh, after doing this you have to simply come inside this uh, cv profile cv delete you can see that this is cv delete and here we are deleting that reference when the user will click on the yes button fine so today just to uh, first thing what we will do is uh, we will write a query so first of all we will delete the data from the real time database and then from storage fine so simply write df and you know guys this df is the database reference that you have to give here you can see that this is a database reference and uh, you can see that this is firebase database reference and this is database reference this is a reference of all users so make sure you give this before proceeding fine guys so after giving that reference we can proceed so here what you have to write is uh, just let me expand this fine guys so after this uh, database reference you have to write order by child and uh, order by child is going to be uid fine and uh, then dot equal to and uh, that will be current user id fine because guys we are also saving the user id in the users data fine so it will do a validation it will check that if value is equals to current user id so it will delete it and if it is not then nothing will happen fine so simply write at listener for single value event fine and uh, then new value event listener then inside it guys you have to simply code that what we will do so here first of all we will write for and uh, then data snapshot fine then data snapshot data snapshot then colon fine and then again data snapshot snapshot fine then dot get children and uh, here we have to starting bracket and inside it guys we will code is data snapshot dot get reference dot remove value so guys it will delete that value if the user id of this user and the user id of the database will be safe fine so after doing this query what you have to do is uh, here we will write uh, storage reference so here we will write storage reference then reference and uh, this will be only ref fine guys so here what i will do is you have to write is firebase storage and then go get instance then 
get reference from url and here you have to pass that url that we are retrieving fine guys and after this you have to write ref dot delete fine and dot add on complete listener new on complete listener and uh, when it is complete so guys we will show the toast message that the profile is deleted successfully fine so simply cut this uh, toast message and you have to paste it inside this complete listener fine guys so now our coding part is almost complete and it's time to run the app and see is it working or not so make sure guys that you have uh, given this reference and uh, also for this real-time database fine so it's time to run the app and see is it working or not so in case if you get any error then let me know in comment section i will try to reply in next 24 hours fine guys and uh, let me open this firebase database storage so guys here you can see that uh, our image is already uploaded here in the storage of our social media app fine guys so now you can see that when i will open this image so you can see that it is the same image that we have uploaded fine so guys now when you will click on this uh, hamburger icon and uh, it will show this bottom sheet and you will click on the button delete and after this guys when you will click on the button yes so it will delete the data and we will have a toast message you can see that this is a toast message data deleted fine and uh, this time when i will refresh this page storage page so you can see that there will be no image fine it means that image is deleted successfully the meaning of deleting the images is that you have to remove the useless data from the storage that is why and here you can see that our uh, data from the real-time database is not deleted fine so I think we should check that why it is not deleted so guys as you have seen that the data is not deleted from the real-time database so for this what we can do is uh, simply here I will check the reference so you can see that this uh, reference for the database fine so here the I think uh, I should open this create profile and here we will see the reference that we are giving while creating the profile so as you can see that this u is caps lock and uh, in this bottom sheet the u is a small so guys that was creating the problem so i will change this u fine and this time when i will click on the run button and i will run the app again and this time guys when i will click on the button so it should delete the data successfully fine guys so let me open the real time database and uh, this emulator fine guys So guys, you can see that the data is uh, inserted here successfully. So when I will click on this hamburger icon, so it will show the bottom sheet. And guys, this time when I will click on the button delete, and also I will choose yes. So it will delete the data from real-time database. Fine. So you can see that the data is deleted successfully. Fine. So I hope you like this tutorial. And uh, guys, please like, share, and subscribe my channel. And don't forget to press the bell icon so you will never miss any update. Thank you for watching.